to the earth I rise, to the earth I one day shall return. It's winter time, everybody. It's, it's, it's the important time for sliding cars, avalanches, hypothermia, frostbite, but most importantly, Whistler. You're supposed, that has nothing to do with Whistler. Whistler is usually pretty cold, and Whistler has lots of cold winters and has moist air. And their average climates are in January, 1 to 5 degrees, February, 3 to 4 degrees, March, <laughs> March, 7 degrees to two, minus 2 degrees. In April, it's 11 to 0. And its average temperatures in the summer is 15 degrees to 5 degrees. So, not that hot, but like, I guess, hot. Animals in Whistler are usually brown bears, cougars, deer, marma, marmots, pika, hares, squirrels, salmon, and many bald eagles. Plants and trees in Whistler are pine trees, cedar, hemlock, and evergreen. They also have lavender, liches, flowers, mosses. The nations in Whistler usually use cedar, uh, red cedar wood for clothes and many baskets. And they hunted lots of fish, that's what they mainly ate, but they'd also hunt deer. First Nations also went sailing a lot. Hello, I'm sorry that Diana couldn't make it for this part, she kind of left. So, um, anyways, more about the Whistler tradition. She, um, they usually take skiing and snowboarding very seriously, and a lot of them do snowboarding and skiing, because as you can tell, it snows a lot there. Uh, we, the, the average distance between Vancouver and Whistler is approximately 75 hours, and it takes 8 hours to go there. That part I did not search up. I definitely know how long it takes to go there. So the animals in Whistler are an apple? Sorry, I'm vegan. <laughs> Come today and try some corn, or else we'll sacrifice your newborn.